Hello and welcome back. Today I have my nail care routine which I do once a week and it has changed since the last video that I posted about nine months ago. It's now less complicated I guess, less products involved and I hope that it works for you as well. Using a bowl in my favorite color, warm water and some body wash, very fancy of me. I'm using, I'm going to soak in my nails for about 2-3 minutes to soften my cuticles and prep them for cleanup. So very gently pat dry my nails as you saw on the towel and using Blue Cross cuticle remover and a Q-tip I apply that on my cuticles. Let it soak in for about 2-3 seconds, not much because they're already soft from the water soaking and very very gently with a cuticle pusher I'm going to push any dirt off my nails as you can see there it may seem that it's going fast but it's because I fast paced this clip in here but it ve go very gently on my nails because I do have I have hurt myself before but this is very easy, you should not go hard on it, and it's, that's it. So I go back into the bowl, and with a brush, I just brush off any cuticle remover residue of my nails and under my nails, and then dry my nails, and look very closely for any hanging nails, cuticle on the side of my nails, or my nail beds, anywhere. And this is the only reason why I use a cuticle nipper. I don't cut my, my cuticles anymore. I used to do that, but I had to stop. And just go in with my favorite. This is by Tweezerman, the one with the rounded base handle. And just cut off that. Surprisingly, I only had two hanging on my nails. So I'm using now a cuticle oil, any cuticle oil or your preference. I like to prep my nails to for them to be sort of wet and soft for when I file them so that that way they're less prone to break or crack or anything. Um, I'm using a glass file, my favorite one, which comes on a case from Sephora and I carry this one with me all the time. I like, to, I like my nails to be shaped square. And you don't see that because of the nail file being clear or white. My corners of my nails are very sharp. So going back in, I'm going to file on the side and on the tip again. Very gently. And this makes the corners of my nails to be very sharp and pointy. So I like to file a little bit on the side to make it more curved and not so square. At least the corner not to be that square. So that way I don't scratch myself again because honestly I have scratched myself before. So I'm going to the other side and file some more and file again on that corner to make it even and just check to make sure that it's not scratchy kind of way. So I'm rubbing in the rest of the cuticle oil and with a Q-tip and acetone I'm going to clean up my nails to remove any oil and then use my Essie's Rich Filling Base Coat because my nails has a lot of bumps to call it that way and this makes it more smooth and makes also applying my nail polish easier. And I also stopped using nail strengthener as a recommendation from Gianna from Nail Storming and that really helped a lot. My nails are not breaking anymore like they used to. When they were at this length, they were breaking a lot. So that's all I do. I hope that you like this. Thumbs up if you do and I'll be talking to you soon. Bye.